All right. I would like to remind those who have signed up to speak to please keep your comments relevant, focused, respectful, and on topic. You will have three minutes to make your remarks, so please be mindful of the clock to your right. And as always, you do not need to use all three minutes to make your point. So I'm going to call you up in groups of, oh, the list got small. Okay. So I'm going to call on, I can't read this, Juma Pillet. Please help me say your name correctly. Juma Pili. Juma Pili, okay. This is my third time here. All right, sorry, I can't remember everyone. And then Jason Guts, followed by Tom McCarthy. Go ahead. Okay, uh, thank you to the mayor and the council. Um, I'm here to ask a question about Tacoma, policing in Tacoma. Um, I attempted to put, I have put in a public request um, through the website. I attempted to address this through the Facebook page. I've attempted to contact you, Mr. Lonergan, several times in which I haven't heard back from you. Um, I've also found that the, city, that the City of Tacoma's Facebook page screens the comments or questions that come in and they don't post them. Um, and I'm going to come back and deal with that at a different time. I'm, I'm a little concerned about that. Um, I called the police department. I asked the question. Um, I was told by Officer Ramirez that an administrator could answer my question when I asked him to provide me a number for one of these administrators. He told me there were hundreds of them and that I would come in and they would deal with me personally. I took that as a veiled threat. I did um, report it to Internal Affairs. So here's my concern. On August 4th, I went to the Best Buy by Tacoma Mall. I witnessed a police car parked in the front lane of the Best Buy. I figured that the police officer was there to arrest um, some shoplifter. But what I discovered is that that was private security. My question is who is paying for that police car that's parked in the fire lane and used as intimidation in front of that business? Um, I, I have suspicions that it is not paid for by the companies, but it's paid for by the city. And I just want to know if we're cool with using tax dollars to benefit public, private companies for profit who should be aligning themselves with the community as opposed to using our police vehicles as intimidation in front of their businesses. So I, I hope I get an answer on this this week because I, I think now we all know that I'm serious about getting one. Okay. Thank you. Now, and I'm going to ask you, did you actually go through our citizen complaint form online and enter this? Yes, ma'am, I did. And we, and we have your email address on file? Yes, ma'am, you okay. do. Right. Thank and you. I'm sure Mr. Lonergan has my email address, too. All right, thank you. 